Freaks, what's going on, everybody? It's, uh, it's the head freak here. It's Big E. Welcome back to the Iron Man Challenge. Hi. That's the Iron Woman. Yes, it is. She is a, a night elf hunter. We're hanging out here in Auburdine. In this episode, we're going to be backtracking a wee bit. What's our bags looking like? Not too bad. Yeah, this thing, we still have that. Mm -hmm. Let's roll. Tracking a couple of quests. We're going to find a corrupt Furbolg camp. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's the Den Mother quest. We're not doing that because we will die. We have the Fall of Amatharan, or however you say that, which is back where we were. We have to read two tablets. And we also are going to go back to the Red Crystal right now and do something. Yeah, we've got this stuff here. Moonwell water tube. Guess we're looking for a reaction or some such thing. Let's work our way in here. Let's get warmed up. Hope everybody is doing well today. If I haven't said that already, I feel like I may have already said it. I don't like... Okay. Get away from me, Thistle Bar. Same day as the last episode. Oh, gosh. Kind of scared me there. Let's focus up here. I don't want to die. This is the Iron Man challenge. This is one of the hardest challenges you can do, if not the hardest. Al freaks, man. Al freaks all over the place. The kitty is level 14. We hit level 14 last episode, and we are going to hit level 15 this episode. Which isn't quite as exciting as it normally would be when you're playing World of Warcraft. Because once you hit level 10, every level thereafter, you get to choose a talent point. Not us. We don't get to do that. We can, though, every even level, see our class trainer and train up abilities. That is allowed. Can you imagine doing this challenge without your class abilities? Insane. Okay, this place freaks me out. There's way too many owls here for my liking. We're going to go up this way. And I'm hoping this doesn't trigger some kind of attack. I don't think it does. My hat is holding my earphones off of my face a little bit, so I, it sounds a little bit weird. Uh, get that. Plenty of junk. Um, I'm just going to be cautious here. Let's just work our way in this way. And the Furl Bog Camp, I think is, it's actually it's like right here, I believe, right before the river or right on the river's edge there. Me thinky, that's right. Let's give the boy some food. Now, I asked for uh, sample pet names, or if anybody had an idea for something. But I'm so far ahead, I've not seen... Please don't let anything happen here. Uh, I've not seen comments, because that video actually isn't even out yet. Report back what we have found. Too bad we can't use any of that. Is everything fine here? I, I want to get out. Let's just get out of here. Don't slide down too far, please. Okay. All right. Looks like we're okay here. 
Okay, we'll do that. We'll report what we found. I don't really know what we found. Some stuff happened. I'll just say that. I'll tell her, well, some stuff happened. Is that what you needed to know? She'd be like, no. Can you be more specific? I'd be like, okay, well, stuff. There was stuff that happened. Yeah. All right. Okay, funny boy. Uh, let me focus up a little here. There's a lot of damn bears. All kinds of them. These are the ruins of Bashalaran. Am I going the right way? Yes, I am. We're going to keep traveling the way that we are traveling here. Um, Blizzard's working on that. They're keeping me informed on their progress. They got 35 of their best working on it. It's, uh, it's, yeah, it's what I heard from the guy running... Uh, well, that's actually from, uh, yeah, the guy running... Who's ever running Blizzard and Microsoft. Yeah, that team. Trying to figure it out. Oh, that's right. We've been here. Yeah, we did this. You gonna pull that? This should be... Suffer no more. Seriously, I can't one-shot a sickly deer? This is a corrupt furrow ball camp. I think I hear the chickens going nuts out there. Oh, they're laying eggs. Okay, I gotta go. Yeah. The chickens make a very specific noise when they're laying their eggs. And it's, uh... It's kind of cartoon soundy sounding right, you gotta go man there's way too much crap around here I don't know how close I have to be <clears throat> I'm pretty sure this is the corrupt camp but without questy it's pretty hard to know Oh my god, these are high level high level freaks in here. Uh, maybe it's down here. I don't actually know where the hell it is. I'm not getting too close to that. I'm will we're in no hurry to do that. Untrack that. We got a bear coming over here, and we pulled it. I need him. Oh, that. This is not a good place for us, man. But we're trapped here because of the challenge in the rule set. We are not able to go to another place. I mean, the safest bet would be just hang out in Darnassus and try to find a mage for a mage port to Iron Forge or Stormwind. But we can't get into a group, and you have to be into you have to be in a group uh, to get that port working. So, yeah, and we can't risk running through wetlands. Not at this level. Crocodiles would destroy us. But that would be the way to get into Loch Madan, and then. And to Dunmoreau, do the starting zones there, which would be green quests and or Goldshire. But we, we're not able to do that, so. 
All right, we don't want to go up that way. Let's get out to the road. Where in the heck am I going? Here's the road. Okay, let's have a look at the... Let's see what we're doing here. Okay, we know where that is. Let's head back to Alberdine. This quest we're going to wait on because this quest is at the bottom uh, of the ocean, off the pier, and it's just too damn risky to do it. I don't, so we're going to hold off. I, we don't have a lot uh, to do here. I mean, the stuff that we have is pretty risky. So let's see if we can level up to 15. Some of this might turn green and make it a little bit easier for us. This corrupt furrow bog camp. I think my instinct was right. I feel like it's just off the road on this side, somewhere up here. I, maybe I just completely missed it. But there is a quest we can go turn in. And where that quest turn in, we can also get this done. The two tablets. And if I was paying attention, we could have already have uh, completed that. But... Oh. Oh, it's this dude. Okay, not where I was thinking. This is what we need to be grinding, these mobs here. There's a worn cloak. Oh, that's actually an upgrade. Look at that. It's trash, too. <laughs> and it's an upgrade for us. That's what this challenge is. I'm going to have to find the best white gear I can. Because the zones that we go to next, we're going to be severely outmatched there. Can't wear any of this, so we'll take what sells for the most, which is the wand. All right. That's done. Is that the druid? Oh, it's the hunter. I like your choice of pets, sir. A lot of people. Hello. How you doing, brother? A human rug there, level 35. Wonder where he's heading. I don't know why he would be going that way. Maybe just, uh, I don't know, mining or something? Who knows? So we might uh, be doing what we're doing now. We might just have to kind of grind some open area yellow mobs or some green mobs, get a couple of levels, and it it'll our life will be a little bit easier in here. Turn this in. I was told I got six front flips in a row in the first or second episode. I thought I had gotten five. I haven't seen it. I'm going to have to go back and find it if I can. Oh, thank you so much. Too bad I can't have that. Oh my god, it's so good for us, <laughs> but we can't have external buffs. Ishnuala. Can't use any of these. So this sells for the most. Farewell. 
Alrighty, let's go see a vendor here. And then we're going to be heading to the... South. Yeah. Food and drink. Drink and baker. All the food you want. Good grief. Like, is there a repair dude? Oh, there are, he's across the bridge. How may I help? Um, you can buy that and that and that. All kinds of bear meat. Maybe it sells? I guess that's all we need. May the stars guide you. Thanks. I'll get my compass and my sextant and my navigational maps. And I'll be by, uh, guided by some stars. And a stopwatch. May not need all of those things. Yeah, we're gonna level. Um, we can get Scare Beast, which is would come in handy, especially in this zone. If I'm fighting a mob, we get attacked by something, I put Scare Beast on it, and we just go. We run. And hopefully it gets scared the opposite way that we are going. But you got to be careful with stuff like that, because that bear could be feared into another bear. And then we've got two additional bears on us. Risk versus reward. That doesn't even really apply in that situation, does it? Oh my gosh. Let's see if we can sell that. Pretty big. I'm going to run this way. I'm going to see if we can come across this corrupt fur bog camp. Buck. So this would have been a perfect opportunity for Scare Beast. But I think we're okay here. Got to let him get a growl on it. Or I start. There we are. Okay. Not a big deal. Some more bear meat. All the bear meat you can stand. We've tried this one. Actually, this might not be the one that we tried. At least these are slightly better leveled. Let me get I'm gonna get a little close to this one. Oh boy, that's rough. Okay, we gotta watch out for the wind talkers. And they run off. Is he ranged? No. Fairy fire on me? No, on the pet. If we got fairy fire on us, we would have negative armor. <laughs> we would have none. Less than none. I probably... I'm not even going to say probably. I We are definitely going to get a boar. I, I really like the play style of the boar. I'm able to... I can play more positionally, more accurately. Oh, this is it. This is it. Yes. All right. I, I, I should have gone with my gut. I guess I didn't go far enough in there. But I don't even think that's the one that we were at. Maybe it is. So let's go back up here. We'll find these two tablets. I know we're... Well, I remember seeing one of them.
A couple of people on the channel are doing uh, challenges, doing the Iron Man challenge. If you're used to playing regular World of Warcraft, it's pretty easy to mess it up. It's You can forget and equip like a green item or use a health pot, learn professions. It's I've messed up so many times doing this challenge. I don't know why I said it like that challenge. <laughs> this might be level 15 here. But if you're serious about doing it, um, there is a website for it, a couple of websites, and you can actually, if you make it, you can, they post your name, your character name, and like the hall, and like a hall of fame, or something like that. We're gonna help this guy out. think he really needed help. I don't know. He looked a little low there. Okay, so one of them's going to be over there. This guy's kind of cleared out, which means I've got to be careful about stuff respawning on top of me. There's just two tablets we need. So if you're using... Oh, there's one right there. If you're using Questy, these things just... They show on the map really easily. So we can't pick a talent point here. All right, we'll take this one. First the cat there. Oh, boy. Okay, we're fine. I thought this mob was coming in on us over here. So here's one. The other one's right over here. He's doing the same quest. I don't think I've ever read those. And if I wasn't doing like this challenge, we would read them. One thing I think a lot of people overlook or maybe don't think about or appreciate is the amount of writing that went in to this game. If you think about how many quests there are in this game, a lot of them tie together, not all of them, but there's so, so much writing. And I guess that's kind of standard. It's one thing I never really thought about. Uh, playing games until I started reading quests actually on this channel. It's really kind of incredible. It'd be interesting. I'd love to see like an interview or something with like some of the original people who wrote the quests for for. Um, vanilla for the original game. Where is this other one at? It This one is... It's Oh, it's actually right here. It's right in front of me. That's a documentary I would absolutely watch. I'm not talking about, like, the famous, like, Chris Metzen and all that. Although it might be cool to hear a little bit from him. But, like, behind-the-scenes people, like, the people who programmed the game, the people who designed the art and everything like that, who wrote the stories. It'd be amazing. I mean, Chris Messon's in, uh, involved a, a lot of it, but you know what I mean. No, we don't know what you mean. Get good, scrub. <laughs> I don't know what that means. It doesn't apply. Okay, this dude, the person we need should be right over here hanging out by a tree or something. There she is. Or he. 
This is a uh, Sentinel Taisha Moonblade. I am honored. Goddess, watch over you. 900 XP. What are we going to do? That goes back to Auberdyne. Not doing that yet. We damn sure am not doing this fucking quest. No thank you. And we cannot do this. So we're kind of screwed here, man. It's not safe to come down into Ashenvale. I think what we have to do here, ladies and gentlemen... And this, there's high-level mobs down here. And there's higher-level mobs up through here, especially back this way. Uh, up this way. We're going to use the Hearthstone. What I'm going to do, I'm going to have to grind green and yellow mobs just in and around Alberdine. Definitely not doing that cave quest. This we could probably do. This is really interesting. I've never seen a reward like this where they offer white and green items. That's really strange to me. It actually seems really unfair, doesn't it? <laughs> to a cloth wearer. Do I dare risk this? So it's out here. You can actually get to it if you jump off this way. And we cannot do the blubber gump thing or whatever because it requires fishing and we're not allowed to learn that profession. Um, let's feel this out a little bit. There's Threshadons and shit down here. And, of course, being in the water, you're at a huge disadvantage. What level are these? Okay, they're actually not that bad. Well, they're kind of bad. My pet. This is what we need. All right, we can take this on. I really hate this. <laughs> I mean, that's kind of on me. I should have dismissed my pet. Oh, there he go. There he is. There he is. There he is. I should have dismissed my pet there. We have to watch out for murlocs. I think there are murlocs here. I actually don't see murlocs. Okay, I'm not going to I'm not going to take a risk here. We're going to get this thing out of the way. There's one over here. Pretty weak sauce. There's the boat. Oh, we got another cloak there. Okay, this isn't too bad. What are you doing? Let's go. Is that an upgrade? It's not. Look how the uh, <laughs> the cat. What if they they did that on purpose? Cats aren't known for their love of water. It depends if you if you've got a kitten and you put it in water a lot all the time. Whatever it gets used to water, but most cats, I don't think like it. But the way that he swims, it's kind of like he doesn't want to be here. <laughs>
It's a pygmy tide crawler party up here. There's the buzz box machine things. I kind of forgot about those. Greetings. Uh -huh. Goddess watch over you. Um, we'll take, uh, 151. This sells for the most. Go in peace. What brings you here? So the rest of them we can just discover ourselves. And there's a, like I said, I think there's like five, at least five more of those things that we can do. Um, we're half an hour in. I guess let's call it an episode. There's not a hunter trainer here. I don't think there's a hunter trainer here. Pretty sure there's not. But we know where one is. It's too bad you can't get rested XP uh, when you go into any building like this. I kind of wish they had done that. So if you're out in the world somewhere and you came across like just some you know, house or whatever. You could just kind of chill. Well, I'll tell you what. I won't scare Beast. It's going to come in handy, especially in this qu this area that we're in. So we're going to fly. And we're going to go train. Hello. Hi. Del Nadris. Thank you. Ooh, I gotta go to the laundromat. Ugh. like two hours just kind of sitting and waiting it's really close though it's just down the street in town we'll leave the po uh, the pet in the matrix so he doesn't uh he has no needs in there. He doesn't get hungry or anything. Is there a quest here? At some point, we come here. There is a quest that we get, but... And I think it's actually from that dude, but it's I think it's a ways off. Alright, let's go see our hunter trainer. And I might as well go to the auction house and see if we can sell some of this stuff. Do 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 What are we doing for money? No, oh, we're up over a gold. Nice. Hello, good sir. And good ma'am. What brings you here? I'd like to train and I'd like to get Scare Beast. Be careful. Let's go see the... The pet trainer. So I am going to need the pet out for this, I think. See up here? Pet trainer. Right there. I am honored. 
Nothing. Level 18. The loon light your path. All right. We're a ways off there. Let's put Scare Beast on the bar. Make our way over to the... The old auction house. Whoops. Yep, yeah, here we go. Are these two things I don't need up here. There's Krill Door. This is based off of somebody who died. In my Honoring the Dead series, I we discover what that guy's all about. Blizzard does that sometimes with in-game memorials, like an actual grave or something, and sometimes it's just an NPC that is walking around, and that's one of them back there. I can't remember that guy's story, but... They were all very sad, I will say that. Alrighty, see if anybody wants this training sword. We can vendor it for three silver, which isn't too bad. Um... We can sell those scrolls, hopefully. Can't use the health pots, so... See if we can get anything for them. That is not really worth it. That's worth it. Anybody want the linen cloth? Wait, 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 never mind. I need the linen. Sell all the meat. Anybody want clam meat? Yes, they do. What about small egg? Mage Royal. Very nice. Light Feather generally doesn't sell, but that's a decent price for it. All right, we'll sell the rest of the stuff, or uh, vendor it. And we may as well just kind of have a look at... So we're using a dagger. Nothing. No white items. Uh, bows. That's it. What you see is what you get. Let's check for armor. We can wear leather. Nothing. Hand stitch leather belt. Not an upgrade. That's currently what we we have, so. Um Ours are better. That is actually better than what we have. We're going to take these. It's only two silver. They're gray, so we can wear them. Boots are pretty good because we have the plus, the extra armor on them. Pioneer bracers, not better. Hands. Ours have the plus eight, so... That's it. That's all there is. We could look at... I don't think we can get a neck piece this early or rings or anything like that. Well, we don't want a mood ring. Alrighty. Let's go get our loot here. And we'll call it an episode. Hey, Mr. Kitty Kitty, sing a song for me. Aquatic miasma? Wow, I wonder where you get that curse. I don't know if I've ever seen that. All right, give me the pants. And uh, let's see, uh, we got a vendor close by here. The fishing vendors over here. There's Krill Door. He sits, he chills, he paces. 
I can't actually have that, but thank you so much for thinking of me. Let's go see the, the fishing people. Thank you so much. I can't have that. I always feel guilty getting rid of uh, people's buffs. Ishnuala. Ishnuala. <laughs> so the woolies, we're going to hang on to the wool. And I'm just going to vendor the sword. Actually, I'm not going to vendor. I'm going to see if I can auction house that. Denadris. Um... She's like, why'd you get rid of my buff? <laughs> I have to. Doing the Iron Man challenge. Alright, let's so make up some bandages here. I think we're trying to get to 80. At 80, we can learn... Uh, I think it's wool. We'll sell these extra bandages. I'm going to get another buff. Thank you so much for that. Get rid of it. Now, I have learned I can't get rid of the pet's buff. I can't right-click on this. I'm trying. So he just gets the buff, which I don't mind. A loon be praised. There you are. Bootylicious. That sounds familiar to me. Um, let's go... No, I, I don't have... Wait a minute. Oh, I think I was trying to get to 75. Okay, we can go train up now. It's going to be over here. Wait. Where's the first aid trainer? I need to ask a guard. It's actually over here, I think. How may I help? Um, profession... First aid. Yeah, it's over this way. Good luck, friend. Thank you. Thanks for marking it on the map for me. I appreciate it. Your alchemy and your herbalism are going to be uh, out here. Like uh, at those places over there. Temple of the Moon. Somewhere over there. I am listening. You can get some meat here. A shah fell out. If you're into meat, you can get some there. Oh, at the wrong side here. It's over here. Can I make that? Oh, almost. There we go. Hey, bro. Greetings. Oh, that's right. Farewell. Yeah, I've got to get four more points, and it's green, which is stupid. You could go through 20 pieces of uh, linen or more trying to get those four points. All right, well, we're going to log out here, and we will wait. Um, well, hold on now. Let me just buy the linen. Do I? No, I don't think I do. Maybe? I've got a little bit of money. How are we doing a time? Okay, it's 45. Let's just buy the linen. And I may as well buy some wool. If it's not too expensive, the linen's going to be cheap. Wool probably not, but we'll be picking wool up. In the next zone, we'll pick wool up in Ashenvale, I guess. We'll get a 20 stack. Hopefully that gets us to 80. It's not guaranteed. Um, yeah. Oh my gosh, it's expensive. Uh, 
Um, yeah, I'm not paying 20 silver. So this person bought it all out, reposted it, which is a good play. It is a good play. Now I could do, I'll tell you what, let's spend, I'll buy these pieces in hope that I get, let me check wool real quick. It's probably not. There's no wool on the auction house. Interesting. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Here he comes. Here comes that kitty, kitty. The kittiest of kitties in all of kitty Tim. Mm -hmm. The kingdom of kitties. He's the kittiest of said kitties. Oh, we got ourselves a 20 stack anyway for a hell of a lot cheaper. Can we do this? We have 11 tries to get four points. I don't think we do it. Oh. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on, five tries. Come on. Yes. All right, I may as well make the rest of these up and get rid of that. Let's go back to the first day trainer. We'll learn wool in case we get it, in case we pick some up. But I don't think we're picking up wool here in Ashenvale. I mean, uh, Darkshore. They designed it fairly well. If you're working your professions as you are going through each zone, you generally, I think it's that third zone you get to, you, you'll start picking up what you need and then silk from your fourth and fifth zones or whatever. Hey, my friend. Do you remember me? What brings you here? Tell you what brings me here. Let's learn anti-venom as well. One fifteen. May the stars guide you. Thanks. We're gonna sell these extra stacks to. Well, there's nobody up here. Jump over there. Damn it! I done did missed it. Done did, dude. Done did missed it. I done did, dude. What brings you here? Would you be interested in some bandages? It's like, not really. Well, I'm going to force them on you. Good luck, friend. Good luck to you, too. All right. Let's wrap it up. Thank you for hanging out. Appreciate it. You guys and gals, take care. Iron Woman and myself will catch you in the next episode. I wish you well. Peace. Peace. <laughs>